exploring the Shake Dimension, no matter the cost. When the Shake King reigns, Merelda's lost. Why stand on a silent platform? Shake the King, save the Queen. And, nah, Rage Against the Machine doesn't really work for this. Oh well. Hey everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Wario Land Shake It. If I sound a bit different, it's because I had to go back to my microphone. I mean, not microphone, but old headset for reasons. Well, uh, just for when I'm recording this for the time being. Because, uh, yeah, my blue snowball microphone, it happens to pick up everything when it's on its highest setting so meaning it also picks up my Wii which makes really loud noises yeah I know how to fix it but I don't feel like you know going into my Wii to you know do something that like just yeah whatever I'm not about to go into the whole technical details with that but yeah on the loudest setting it picks up that weird noise and then um, on the second to highest setting the next setting down I just sound really far away and just robotic, so yeah, I just decided to go back to the headset. It works fine, uh, but yeah, whatever. It's no big deal. I'm going to go ahead and just move all my information over to my Wii U. Yeah, I've been postponing that ever since I got my Wii U, but yeah, once I move everything to the Wii U, I should be able to record with my microphone as normal. But enough about that. Let's go ahead to the map and tackle the first boss. Hopefully it won't be too bad. Okay, Roland Rattle. Oh, wait, no. Oh, that is his name. Roland Rattle. Huh, my temple is here too. Okay then. Roland Rattle Battle. Heh. <laughs> How nice. That... Is that a rhyme? Yes, that's rhyme. What is wrong with me? I, I forgot what rhyme is. I'm a horrible English student. Maybe I haven't had an English class in ages. Yeah, let's go. Okay. So the Murfles are using their power to break the seal. And in here we go. I forgot how to fight you, guy. Uh let's see, when you do that. Okay, so I think I have to hit the blue. Alright, alright, alright. I have to relearn this fight. I'm a bad gamer. Okay. Yeah, oh. Alright, then I do that. So I guess I have to hit you on the other side now. Ah, oh, crap. Come on, Warrior, get up. This is all I have to do, really? Okay, then, um... You're gonna switch it up, right? Oh god, yeah, you are definitely switching it up. Just gotta watch out for those, because they explode. Am I supposed to be doing something else here? Those are blue. I think I stand... Oh, yep. Stand on them. And then I'm able to hit them. Once. Alright, but it's not that bad of a boss fight. It's simple enough. And then to hit you again... Does this get any more difficult? <laughs> okay, he's rid of those. Okay, I think I have to make my way to his skull now. Ah, oh, crap. The spikes hurt. You gotta watch out for the spikes. What, what am I doing here? Wait a minute. I think I want to be here. Yes, I do. So can I just stand up here? Ha ha! And he is defeated! That took quicker than expected. Um, wow. Okay, and I apologize in advance if there's just tremendous amounts of clipping with this. It's been a minute since I've used this headset. I've... Ugh. Microphone might be a bit too close. Whatever. What is up with Wario's infatuation with shaking his ass? Oh well, boss has been beaten. Seriously, I was expecting that to be a bit 
bit harder, but eh, whatever. And we get a boss emblem. Alright, so let's go ahead back to the map. Stop by the pirate shop first because we're going to need to. I think I have plenty of money for all the things I wish to purchase now. Okay, yeah, yes, that's why I came here to buy a new map. Yes, and the heart vessel. Yes, thank you for stating the obvious. Let's go ahead and get area map two. Wow, these are kinda expensive. Yeah. At least we can go to area two. Sold out of that. Opening movie. Yeah, no. I want that heart vessel, though. Do I want a recovery potion? Eh, no biggie. The only reason I died on that one level is because it was a secret level, and the secret levels are harder, so, yeah. No biggie. I'm not even going to worry about the heart vessels until I get to, like, Area 4. Unless I have a lot of trouble in Areas 2 and 3, but I highly doubt it. I haven't been doing too bad. It was just that secret level that, you know, rocked my face. I'm going to have to do it again, too. <laughs> Oh, goodness. Goodness, goodness. Do not want. Okay, then. So, now let's go back to the map and get what we missed here. I wonder, does it show the... Oh, it won't. So, I guess that's when I beat the game then. Because, yeah, you can refight the bosses and then they'll have missions of their own. But there's sort of like the standard things like beat the boss without taking damage, uh, do this certain action during the fight. Yeah, it's whatever. So anyway, whoopsie desert. Let's go ahead and go for that treasure that we missed. It's going to be at the end. Oh boy. Okay, that took quite a few tries for me to do. All right, but well, we got the ancient digital watch. And now to leave this stage. Can I still get the little bomb thing? Yes, I can. Okay, that's one less mission I'm going to have to worry about on my own time. And Wow. So even getting the little time bonus for that is... Possible too. Holy crap. So, if I hadn't gone for the chest, I could have got that mission done. Don't know how to get 30,000 coins though, but eh, that'll be something I worry about on my own time. Well, then, that went well. So, now onward to Foul Waterfalls. And here we are at this treasure, the key to my heart. Aww, what a nice treasure to have. All right, time to beat this stage. I doubt I'm gonna get, the nope, I didn't get the time bonus. Oh well. All right, so with Foul Water Falls complete, we can go on to the next stage where I need to collect a treasure. And that will be Rundown Pyramid, the second one. Shouldn't be too tough. Okay, and with that, we got the Moonstone. I was kind of scared for a minute, like, wait, where am I shooting myself to? But, eh, all's well that ends well. Okay, so might as well just keep talking. We're just running, trying.
trying to make our way to the end of the stage. Nothing really to dodge, damn it, why did I jump? Probably could have had... Yeah, I probably could have had the time if I would have just kept going. What is the time, actually? Uh... Wow, so even with uh, stopping to grab that treasure chest, I think I would have been fine. Oh, wait, no. We gotta deal with right here. But then again, you kind of need to go up there to get that little speed boost, and then if I would have kept going there, I wouldn't have to go down here. Yeah, I think I could have had it, but I screwed up in a few spots. But, oh, well, at least I got the Moonstone. We're playing Pokemon now. I'm gonna go ahead and involve me a Clefairy. Because, you know, I, I can. I always prefer Clef... Wait, actually, no. Why would I Why would I evolve a Clefairy? I'm, I'm better off using that on a Nidorino. Get a Nidoking. Hell yeah. Nidokings are better. Never really used Jigglypuff or Wigglytuff. I would just always rely on Needle King, Needle Queen, and, uh, Clefable. Metronome used to be my junk back in Gen 1. But oh well, at least we beat the level and we completed two missions, not breaking any unibuckets and completing the stage without taking damage. Oh boy. And now, the part I am dreading. Going back to this place for two treasures. Do I dare do that now, or keep that with, like, secret level stuff? Like, just go back and do all the secret levels in one video at the end of the LP. Because I found this secret level by pure luck, because uh, you don't even get hints as to where to find the maps for the secret levels until you beat the game. Uh... You know what? Yeah, I'll do just that. Might as well. I'm, I'm, in, I'm still in a good mood. I don't want to ruin it right now by going back here. Besides, like I said, that's probably going to be the only secret level I find on my own because I forgot where uh, pretty much the rest of them are. And a Murphle will tell you where to like sort of search to find them once you beat the game. So, yeah, all the secret levels will just wait until the end of the LP. But if I happen to stumble across another one like I did with that, I'll go ahead and do it just for the hell of it. So let's go ahead and look at the treasures we found. Oh boy. Let's see, Cheese Pyramid. Supposedly this is how the great mouse rulers of the past are entombed. Interesting. Like what giggles. It turns out you can bottle laughter. Who knew? Ancient digital watch. Hard to read and too bulky to wear on your wrist, but at least its battery never runs out. Haha. -ha. Recyclable bottle. This bottle can be returned to the store to get your deposit back. Yay! Silver armor. Armor forged pure silver. Stylish? You bet. Practical? Not in the slightest. Well, yeah, because silver... Yeah, silver and gold are, like, really malleable, so... Making armor out of those? Not the best idea. So that being said, why is gold armor so revered in Minecraft? Unless it's just for the decorative purposes, because... Yeah. Uh, anyway, the key to my heart. What was the heart of that special someone? Be your own Cupid! I could really use that in real life. Manly Maui, it's hard to compete with the manliness of a guy made completely of stone. They are kind of right about that one, actually. Moonstone, this rock probably came from the moon. I mean, <laughs> just look at it. One heavy spear, this will probably hurt a lot if you got hit with it, but you'll have to lift it first. And uh, instant Tutan Ramen, it's been 3,000 years since someone poured in the hot water. The noodles may be a bit soggy. Ew, nobody likes soggy noodles. So, yeah, I guess that was from uh, the secret level, so we'll be getting those later on. Yeah, there are quite a few treasures in this game. Oh, well, and let's look at this here boss emblem, symbol of the ancient civilization. Interesting. Alright, that's going to be it from me for today. Next time, we're going to head on over to Area 2, Wiggly Wild, and we're going to start things... <laughs> Oh my god, that is a great name. We're going to start things off with Just Planes. That is a great level name. That that really is. I love the Wario... Just the Wario series style of humor. You know, what with the platforming games and the WarioWare series, the style of humor is just really good. But yep, we'll be... Blah, 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 blah. We'll be doing that 
and more next time. So thank you all for watching and see you next time for some more Wario Land Shake It. Fade out as we watch Wario's ass.